Hey guys, I'm Ellie and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my Christmas gift guide for 2018. I've come up with five different categories and there are five items in each category, which brings us to a grand total of 25. Look at that, we can do math. Give yourself a pat on the back. And make sure you check out the description box if you're interested in purchasing any of these items. I will have all of the links to everything I talk about and show down there. And also, make sure you stick around to the end of the video for my holiday giveaway. But that's all I have to say right now, so let's jump into the gift guide. The first category is fashion, and something I think is a really easy gift to give someone is jewelry. One of my recent favorite accessories has been a watch. I especially love the watch bundles from Daniel Wellington, and they were kind enough to send me some watches to show you guys, and I'm actually so stoked about this because they are stunning. So the first one I'm wearing is on my wrist right now. This is the classic petite Melrose watch with the bracelet. This one is gorgeous. I love all of the gold going on. It's so classic. It matches everything. And I also have this watch right here, which is the Saint Maz and Rosalyn. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. And this one actually, instead of coming with a bracelet, it comes with an interchangeable watch strap. It's this maroon color, which can be a fun little pop to any outfit. This Christmas, you can get 15% off with my promo promo code ellejune15 online at danielwellington.com or in stores through December 31st. The next item is a good pair of boots for the winter time and I actually just ordered this pair that you're seeing right now and they came in the mail today and I'm so excited about them. So boots or any shoes would be a great gift. I found the cutest scarf hat and mitten set on Amazon and I thought it was adorable and it would make the perfect gift because it's like a three in one deal. You don't have to search for each individual thing. So you can just order it, wrap it up and give it to them for Christmas. Bam, perfect, done easy and they can wear it all winter long so it's great. Next is one of my personal favorites and that is Christmas pajamas. Honestly, who doesn't like Christmas pajamas? There's probably some people out there, but I love Christmas pajamas. I got myself a Christmas onesie from Abercrombie and Fitch last year and it is so warm and cozy. It has this hood, it's awesome. I have worn it in public because it's just too comfy. I'm not gonna take it off and change into real clothes to go get my Maverick hot chocolate. But there's tons of cute Christmas pajamas everywhere and this would probably be more of like an earlier Christmas gift so that they can actually get the chance to wear them. There's lots of different places you can look but this would be a fantastic gift. I thought a good winter jacket would be a really nice gift because jackets and coats are pretty pricey. Last year I asked for a good winter coat for Christmas because I needed a new coat but I didn't want to spend all that money on it. So asking for a good winter coat or jacket is always a good idea. Moving on to the next category which is tech. The first thing that I'm actually personally going to be asking for this Christmas are computer glasses. This would be the perfect gift for someone that does a lot of computer work. So I will link some good computer glasses in the description box that actually work because not all of them do, but this would be a great gift. This next thing is something that I think would be so useful and that is a photo printer that you can connect to your phone. One of my New Year's resolutions is going to be to like print more physical pictures so that I have real tangible memories. So this would be such a fun gift, I think. The next one kind of goes along with the other one, but this is a Polaroid camera. And I know that the little colored Fujifilm ones are super trendy a couple years ago. They're probably still really trendy. And you could ask for one of those or something that I think would be so cool is like a real Polaroid camera that prints like bigger pictures. I think it'd be really fun to have the bigger size pictures or the small ones. Either way, a Polaroid camera is a really fun thing to have. Okay, my next idea is to ask for the Google Home or the other ones. I don't really know any of the other ones, um, but I have the Google Home Mini actually and my brother gave it to me for Christmas last year and I really love it. It's really handy to like ask it any questions about, I don't even know what I ask it. I mostly play music off of it which is super nice. It's like a speaker and a little helper all in one, but it's a pretty handy little device and I love mine. The last item in the tech section is a portable charger and I recently saw this one and I think it is so cool. It's very modern and clean looking it's like a little circle wood looking thing so it's not like a weird big bulky charger but portable chargers are always handy to have because you never know where you're gonna need them and this is something that I feel like oh yeah that's a good idea I should get one of those but then I never buy it for myself if that makes any sense so I think it would be a good gift 
All right, next category is beauty. And I feel like beauty products are pretty easy to shop for around the holidays because there's lots of kits and things. So it's a really easy, just like one purchase, wrap up the box and you're done. So I love that. I'm a big fan of gift sets and gift kits. I was actually just at Sephora and they have the cutest makeup beauty sets. But my first idea is to get them a lipstick kit just because getting new lipstick is always fun. You can try all the different colors and I feel like I wear lipstick the most around the holidays. So this is something that I would personally love. The next one is another set idea. It doesn't have to be, but I know that Sephora has little like travel size perfume sets with samples of all different scents of perfumes. And I think this is an excellent gift to just be able to try out all the smells and decide which one you like the best. The next one is another kit. Actually, I'm technically all of the beauty ones are kits, but a skincare kit. I've seen skincare kits with like lotion and face masks and face wash. So I think that's a super great gift because who doesn't like doing a face mask? So this one isn't technically in a set, but I bet you could find one that is. But you can get an eyeshadow palette for someone. Getting new makeup is just so much fun, at least for me. I love experimenting with different things and I don't generally go out and just splurge on new makeup products. So I think that they make terrific gifts. And last but not least for the beauty section is another kit and you can get them a nail polish set. There are tons of these around the holidays. I remember I got a nail polish set with like 20 different nail polishes when I was probably 13 and I was so excited about it. But it's so much fun because then it's like, bam, here's a whole nail polish collection for you. You don't have to go out and buy 40 separate different nail polishes. This next category is stocking stuffers. So these could be little things that you could ask for in your stocking or there would be great ideas to give to friends. But my first idea is phone cases. And I know this is kind of generic, but I personally need a new phone case. Mine is like breaking. So I'm actually asking for this, but everyone loves having a new cute phone case. This next idea is also pretty basic and that is to get someone a gift card. They can kind of pick out their own present. So get them a gift card to their favorite restaurant or their favorite store and I'm sure they'll be happy. Water bottles and cute mugs. For some reason, I feel like I can never have enough of those. And a super easy present is to get like a mug and fill it with candy and then bam, you're done. But these are also pretty practical gifts and they're things that people will actually use. Again, with the gift sets, I have another one of those for y'all. And this is like a bath kit, I guess it would be. Something with like bath salts or bath bombs and lotion and maybe a soap or something. So I guess this could kind of be a spa day kit in a way. Um, and you can also DIY this too. And my last stocking stuffer idea kind of goes along with the spa kit, but that is to get candles and lotions. I know at Bath and Body Works, they have lots of sales around the holidays and you can like buy three and get three for something, I don't even know. And I feel like that's a really simple, basic, easy gift, but everyone appreciates it because who doesn't need more good smelling lotions? The last category is just miscellaneous items, random things that I came up with. And the first one in this category is a planner. I am so addicted to my planner. It is like the weirdest thing. And there are tons of cute planners out right now for the new year. You could order one somewhere or I usually just get mine from Target because they're always really cute and they've worked well for me. So if you have someone in your life that's like super into being organized and planning things, this is a great gift if they haven't already bought a planner for themselves, which I have. Santa, if you're watching this, don't get me a planner. My next idea is for all the readers in your life. Getting them a new book would be a great idea. You could give them a book that you love or one that you know that they want. All those bookworms will definitely appreciate it. Next up, we have home decor, and this could be so many different things. In my mind, when I think of home decor, it goes straight to throw pillows, or you can get them like a nice cozy blanket. Oh, you know like the, what are the, the big chunky knit blankets? I would love one of those. Okay, this one's kind of random, but <laughs> I also have another strange addiction to pens, which is like so weird. I have an addiction to pens and planners. 
There you go. Now you know my deepest, darkest secrets. But I love new pens. Like a whole package of all the different colors is so exciting. And I'm like, yes, I'm gonna use these and I'm gonna color code everything, which I never do, but I always say I'm going to and I always think I'm going to. So you could even get someone like a planner and a little pack of pens. I'm sure they would be ecstatic about that. And the very last item I think is such a sweet idea and that is to make a photo book. I've seen tons and tons of different places all over the internet where you can make your own photo book and just put in your pictures and then they ship it to you. And I think this would be such a cute idea. You can get this to your mom, your friends, your significant other, your brother, your sister, your dad, your grandma, your grandpa, like anybody, your dog, anyone would love this. So this would be a perfect gift for pretty much anyone in your life. All right, that wraps up my gift guide. And now let's move on to the giveaway. This giveaway is obviously in honor of the holidays happening and also to thank y'all for 100 thousand subscribers which I still can't believe is real and I have all the items right here so I'm going to show you everything and then we'll go over the rules and how you can enter and win so the first item is this gold necklace like I said you can't go wrong with jewelry next we have a lip kit like I was talking about this is Bare Minerals Lunar Lip, and it has really pretty, very neutral colors. This is the hat, mitten, and scarf set I was talking about earlier. And I ordered you your own, don't worry. This is mine that I got for myself. <laughs> but then I loved it so much that I wanted one of you to have it. Um, so this is the scarf, and it's just cream colored, so it's very neutral to match all your winter coats and everything. And then it also has a super cozy beanie, and it's so cute. Oh, guys, I'm gonna go out and play in the snow. Except there's no snow right now. And then it also has mittens, and these are so warm. They're all lined inside. How cute would you be out looking at Christmas lights? So cute. You want this, I promise you. And like I said, you won't be getting this exact one. I ordered yours, so it's completely brand new, unused, but we can be twinning. Oh, how exciting is that? Then you can send me pictures in your little winter set. Okay, what's next? Again with the kits, I got you this skincare kit. It has a face wash, a day and night cream, sleep hydration sleepover mask, and a lip balm. This is so fun. I just love stuff like this where it has more than one thing in it. It's just so exciting. I also got you a planner and it's the same one that I got myself. Just the cover's a little bit of a different design and I kind of like yours better, but I'll let you have the best. And I am so excited to actually use this planner this year. Let me just give you a sneak peek. When you open it up, it tells you like how to use this planner. It talks about goals and how to like stay on course and design your days, which is awesome. It has a spot for your morning routine and your night routine. And then when you get into the real planner, it has the monthly layout, which is pretty typical. Then, this is what I'm really excited for, is the daily look of it. So each day, it has a top three list where you write down three things you wanna get done most of the day, and it has a schedule, and it has a to-do list, and this is so exciting, it has a gratitude section. And each day, it also has a little cute quote at the top. So, this is an awesome planner. Like I said, I bought it for myself. I'm so excited to use it. All right, next. Like I said, I went to Sephora this morning. I was haunting for this for so long, you guys, because I wanted you to have it. It is, oh, I can smell it, it smells good. This is the perfume set that I was talking about. It has seven rollerball perfumes in it so that you can try them all out. It smells so good. The very last thing, guys, I, saw, I found this at Joann's because I'm a grandma and I was shopping for yarn and I was like, it's a done deal, I'm buying that. It's this little mug. And it says joy on it and it comes with a little bath set in it. it has shower gel body lotion and bath salts how cute is that i thought it was like the perfect christmas gift so that's everything and that you will be winning in my giveaway so now let's move on to the rules and how you can enter there's four really easy steps Number one is to obviously be subscribed to my YouTube channel. You need to follow me on Instagram and like this picture that you're seeing right here. And then you need to tag three friends in the comments of that picture. The giveaway will be closed on December 15th and the winner will be announced on Instagram. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this gift guide was helpful and gave you some ideas. And I also hope that you'll enter my giveaway because you never know, you just might win this time. I hope you have a very Merry Christmas and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Underneath the Christmas tree.